It's probably a date. So you see, Starla, I have some very important news for the very first time. Especially the date. What can I do for that, Mercy? Well, Mr. Thomas has people tomorrow. And what day is it? Tomorrow on a Saturday. Anyway, that was a presentation. Yeah, get away. So you see, Starla, are you excited or what? Well, I still don't know. We conquered the universe altogether. I think this thing is all the date. Just as Curly wants to do it all right. <laughs> oh, don't worry. Just be yourself. Maybe you should just do it for once. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Starla. I gotta go and conquer the universe. Yes! I... <laughs> uh... Listen, I know exactly what they said. What? Well, the only thing that was so that they don't know actually know is where we are. Whatever you do, just get all of the tickets and beat them. Well, we raised only once. Just a little bit. Hmm. So what's that supposed to mean? I expect we don't remember. I I talk to him? Sure, it wasn't in the stomach. You mean that starts for getting dressed? <laughs> Maybe we should go in the garage and see what's going on. But I'm... Do you want? Yeah, me too. Let's go to the dump. And I have a special plan for you to fix it. What, Austin? Here we are! Out the dump! And fish is everywhere. You mean that one's in the damn top of the clothes? Oh, that was so gross. Here's the green sweater. I think the green one is my favorite color. Well, it's always been you then. This shall indeed to be a long night. Now listen, all you have to do is face my ultimate type of weapon, use the money, and there's the money you always want. I get them every time. <laughs> See, here you go. Awesome! Now I can call Curly White right now. Hey there. My name is Mercy, the Fancy Woman. So, what are you doing, Mercy? With, uh, acting like a fancy woman. Why don't you just take a look? Well, okay, if you exist. And then we'll talk to Mr. Cuddles. This is public gold. Why do I do it? I never know the clue. Let me try it. Can you try it? But I can't. Oh, just do it. That will teach you it, Mrs. Public Gold, okay? Okay, I'm sorry for being such a mean, Miss Pugwinkle. This thing is always too far. You mean sure a lot is dumb? Even better than we said to have fluffy ones. And you always want my friends? Why are you the shame of yourself, Mr. Pugwinkle? Everybody always is messy, China! Mercy. Just get in the living room. Oh, uh, man, too bad there's no way to get out of this. What's that, Mercy? Eh, I suppose. I know place to trade in. Really? Who is it? You're the trading! Just like a web under places for the date. What is that supposed to mean? It means the woman's. We can fancy too. And the woman loves oh, that. What is that supposed to mean? Like, get ready to bunch down. Population? You. Okay, let's do this training. Good. No, no, this is boss man. I was supposed to you can't do this for a day. It's so annoying. Ah, I'm sorry, boss man, but you're fired. Can you look just like in the place where you can destroy the galaxy whatsoever? <laughs> Looks like I'm catching for some seas. Is that on your cards? Why can I show you against not even just love? You don't need that heart. Now get ready to dress up as a fancy woman. Agreed! Good job, fancy woman! You're still training! High five! Oh, you just tried to block him? Okay. 
How about a Dark Supplies? Oh, I know some spies. And I didn't tell you where Dark Supplies! Sorry, DJ, the rules are the rules. You can't even. Hey, why do I want to tell you not to? Oh. This is gonna be the greatest day ever! Come on, Percy! Wow! So long. Maybe I'm all done for training. It's time for a date. But I can't. Those things are recurring. I and Mercy will be giving up this morning for a date. So imagine this funeral. A funeral? Yeah, look. Every day at school. You take on the house and see me for once for a while for a ultra eternity. Can you just a little while? Mr. Carlos died, but you was at the funeral. Can you want to join? What day is the funeral doing? It's Saturday, 4 p.m. Is this a day? <laughs> oh, um, nice to meet you. It doesn't matter. How about you give me a hug? Want you? Mm. Oh. Okay. Thanks. <coughs> or some kind of mystical toad. What day is the funeral? So, um... It's a shame that I slept that all night. Yeah, I suppose. Yeah, me neither. Look, a baby just wants to take a picture. <laughs> Wanna see? <laughs> no, I'm not letting this to you. Yeah, that's what it you off. Why don't you stop and I'll fire so you do not I've never seen like this before in my lifetime! Stop as a nightmare! <laughs> hey! I'm trying to kill you! Get out of my sight! Uh, yes! <laughs> That's a good girl, you! I'll never be down to your lesson! Oh, the old old inside the way. Can I use the bathroom? Sure. Thanks. Don't seem to come out until you say so. <sighs> Lona, that's fire! Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait, is that a window? Just ignore her, okay? Oh, gee. Yeah, well, he's said give it a try. Come on, little fella. Who's the spider? Oh, good boy, mister. <laughs> Wait, I don't remember what to say. Just ignore her. No, no, no. Aha! Ow! Hi! Hi! <laughs> Did you just pop for Mr. Cuddles? He's alive! Yeah, you're right. How would you think? What would save him? You do yourself. You know, the spider, Mr. Cuddles, and he's along. Something bit me. Oh, okay. Get ready to leave now. Yeah, I guess you're right. Just a matter of fact. But anyways, I have to go now. See ya. Thanks. Bye. <sighs> okay, I can't sleep. Just a toy, so you know. Well, it's just great to be awakening, but again. Wow! At least you okay, Mercy! Hello, Mercy! Okay. I want you to say sorry to Mr. Cuddles. Hey, but we learn to apologize. Isn't that right, Mr. Cuddles? <laughs>